Hey, what's up everyone? Uh, hope you guys are well. I've got a really funny and interesting story I want to share today with you guys. Um, as you know, I got a set of golf clubs recently, well, I don't know, a couple weeks ago. Uh, here are these golf clubs uh, from my father-in-law. And uh, I finally got a chance to play golf. Um, what was it two days ago? And my wife goes to this English school, and in her particular class, there is another, an older woman uh, named Michiko. Uh, she's 69 years old, and uh, her and her husband play golf all the time around here. So um, I was invited to go play with them. And uh, we went up into the mountains here in Nagano. Uh, really nice course, not so long, not so hard, not so easy, uh, kind of a little bit of everything. Uh, I got some pictures all through on the end of this video so you can see what the course looked like. Um, I was so rusty, man. I l could not hit the ball for my life. Um, but I had a few good holes and it was really, really fun. I had It was a beautiful day. Um, had a good time with uh, Michiko and her husband, Hideo. And um, it was just a good day. Afterwards, we went to an onsen right around the corner. And... That is my first onsen ever and first onsen in Japan. So, uh, basically we pull up and we go inside. Uh, I pay a ticket. I think I paid like go hyaku in, which is uh, about five bucks or something like that. And um, so I, tell, I say to her husband, uh, kudasai, uh, which means basically teach me please uh, how to do onsen. So... <laughs> Um, there's a woman's side, and then there's a men's side, of course, it's divided, um, uh, and we go into the men's side, we walk in, and we get in there, and there's a section where you will store all your clothes, uh, it's kind of like a, a locker room, not a locker room, but a dressing room, I guess, I don't know, hard to explain, cubby holes everywhere, uh, where you just take off all your clothes and put your stuff in a cubby hole. And then from there, you take a little towel and you go into the main uh, room where there's two big baths. And uh, on the other side, there is a wash area where there's many different like showers and uh, wash areas, wash stations. So you're naked at this point. Um, from the changing room, you're naked. And I have no problem being naked, um, whatever. It was uh, fine for me. So we go in, we wash, and um, you, wash your sh you shampoo your hair really good, you shampoo your body, you rinse off. And then from there, you can go right into the one of the baths in that room. But we actually went out to the Rotenburo, which is outside uh, with a view. So you get to see mountains and um, also sit in a hot spring bath. And relax and it was very very beautiful uh, man really really relaxing a uh, bunch of other people in there not too many it was a couple people in the Rotenburo, um for a little bit then it was just me and uh, Hideo uh, relaxing for a while and we had some nice conversation about uh, onsen in Japan and this particular onsen we went to so we sat in there for about 15 minutes and then uh, could enjoy the view and then from there we went back inside to the main bath area and we sat in one of the different baths. Um, that particular bath on the inside was 40 degrees Celsius. Um, the Rotem Budo on the outside was I believe 45 or 46 maybe. I, I, maybe 45. Um, so, but it felt great. It felt really great. Um, the temperature outside was uh, not hot, not cold. Um, maybe, I don't know, mm, hard to say, I don't really know what the temperature was outside, but it wasn't humid, uh, it was nice to relax in the Rotenburo, and like I said, we went back inside, sat in there as well for about 15 minutes, um, only a couple people inside there, uh, nobody in our bath, there was two other people in the other bath, so no worries about crowds or anybody, and then, uh, from there you go rinse off, at another rinse off station and then you go back inside and change and um, very simple very easy 
Uh, maybe uh, everyone was surprised in there to see Foreigner. Because um, I was the only Foreigner. But no worries, it's all good. I don't mind being looked at. I don't have a problem being naked. Whatever, it's all good for me. Yeah, you know, uh, being naked around a ton of Japanese guys or all these, you know, Japanese guys are probably more embarrassed than I am. But <laughs> it was a little funny. Um, you know, of course, you don't look down at anybody. Um, you know, you keep your eyes forward, straight ahead. Um, but yeah, it was, you know, it was a good time. Um, you know, me and Hideo, you know, he, no problem there. He's 69 year old guy. I don't think he's, uh, worried about being shy either, but you know, I'm, I'm not shy when it comes to being naked. I don't really care. I mean, I'll take my clothes off, you know, for the onsen. Definitely. It was worth, uh, it was worth it. So, um, but I'm sure probably all the other guys in there, the Japanese guys, you know, they're, whoa, foreigner, whoa, foreigner, whoa, Gaiku Gujin, whoa. You know, uh, maybe first time for them seeing a foreigner in the onsen. Um, so, yeah, it was really interesting. My first time, my first onsen in Japan. Uh, had a good time. It was very relaxing. Uh, a little bit of rest in the golf game. Uh, but that's what happens when you don't play golf for two years. Uh, so now I got a set of clubs here. And uh, I'm looking forward to some more golf. Uh, so we'll see what happens. I'll keep y'all informed. Hope you enjoyed the story. See y'all later.